This case considered the issue of the duty to act independently and whether or not a barrister was liable for his actions in arranging a compromise with the counsel of the other party. In this case, a man brought an action against their barrister because the barrister had approached the other party to a dispute and had arranged for a compromise which they argued had not been given the authority to do so. The barrister argued that he did not know that he was not authorised and actually believed he was authorised to enter into the compromise to the action. The central issue 